When we think about overpowered accessories, we usually think about the mega accessories. Accessories that have huge crafting trees, that are crafted with a lot of ingredients and a lot of crafting operations. These are great, of course. They can give you immunity against some debuffs. They can give you accessories that have incredibly good damage increases. And they can even give you the best boosts that you can find in the entire game. Oh, but wait a second. Can they? If you look at the game in its entirety, even though the complex mega accessories are great, there can often be a lot of power that lies in the simple ones. Sometimes even more than what is offered by their more complex and sometimes thought to be better versions. You've seen the thumbnail, you've probably already guessed what we're gonna be talking about today. So I'm just gonna stop wasting our time. For this video, we're talking about the simplest pre-boss accessory that you can use up until the Moon Lord. The Frog Lord. Alright. I'm gonna make this quick and concise, since there's really not much to talk about at all. The frog leg is a simple accessory, one that could even be the first accessory you obtain in a playthrough. To obtain it that early on, all you have to do is chop down a tree, craft a fishing rod, travel towards an ocean or a lake of some kind, get some canned worms in chests while you're traveling there, get to the ocean or lake, and fish. Of course, if you want to make fishing easier, since the frog light is a pretty rare item, you could always just mine some ores, or find a fishing rod in jungle chests, or buy one from a traveling merchant. And if you don't find any canned worms in chests while you're going to the ocean, then you can always just get some money and wait for the merchant to arrive so you can buy a bug nut. Destroying small rocks in the forest, or destroying the bushes in the jungle are always incredibly easy and quick ways to get some bait. Alright, alright, alright. We get it now. It's quite an easy to get accessory that no one uses because no one likes to fish. Yes, yes, we got it. But what does it do? Why do you keep bragging on about how overpowered it is and how you can use it up to the Moon Lord? Well, I'm glad you asked, dear viewer, because this is going to be a smooth transition to the fact that a frog slug synergizes well with basically all vertical movement accessories. Yes, but wait, wait, let me explain. The frog leg and its upgrades are sort of unique as accessories, although they're not really all that special. They slightly increase your jump height and speed, they give you auto jump, and they increase your fall damage resistance. Again, nothing special. Their real strength comes when you use other vertical movement accessories alongside them. Using them with a shiny red balloon can effectively quintuple your jump from 6 blocks to 32 blocks. Using them with rocket boots, it's quite a good way to increase your vertical mobility. Using them with fledgling wings effectively makes them feel like hard movements. And using them with a bundle of balloons and all of the previously mentioned accessories can give you near to fisher wings level mobility before you even fight your first boss. And already, just using pre hard mode accessories as examples, you can already see that this is absolutely overpowered. And with hard mode wings and above, your vertical mobility is just... unmatched. This accessory is just completely overpowered, isn't it? Oh, but it gets better. You see, the frog leg has four upgrades. In my opinion though, only really one of them is worthwhile. Frog webbing is good, I suppose, but it's just better to use the tired climbing gear for the master ninja gear. Frog flippers are just... Uh, why? Why would you use this? You can combine these two to get a better accessory, which is the frog gear. But again, I don't think it's that good. No. What I'm talking about, of course, are the amphibian boots, which you can craft using sailfish boots and frog oil. In my opinion, this accessory is even better than what's thought to be the unbeatable ultimate boots, which is Terra Spark, of course. 
It combines the insane vertical potential of the frog leg and the much needed horizontal speed of the boots. And hey, if you're using this, you're technically saving an accessory slot. Sounds good, right? And that's that, everyone. See, told you this would be a pretty short video. Thank you for listening and watching the video, and hopefully, if you've never used this accessory before, this video might have changed your mind about it. Now, goodbye, and see you in the next video. Bye!